I don't think I know what freedom really means because, well, I've never been held captive. Not in a physical sense, anyway. Uh, as a white male living in a Western country, I'm possibly the most free person on the planet, and I don't want to take that for granted. But the greatest trick that we pull on ourselves is to think that we are trapped by something when we are not. The government, our family, our job, our friends, the weather, the global pandemic. But none of these things can hold me captive unless I want them to. The government may put a, a mask mandate or vaccination mandate in place, but they're unable to force me to do either. It's my choice to say yes or no to them. I am free. Just because I have a wife and young children doesn't stop me from doing what I want to do, whenever I want to do it. My employer cannot make me turn up to work every day. I can choose to do that or not. My friends, well, they may not agree with the choices that I make, but their opinion cannot stop me from living my life. And hot weather is not going to stop me from going for a long run, and cold weather is also unable to. And a virus cannot stop me from going out and enjoying my life. What I am not free from are the consequences of my actions. Sure, I can choose to ignore government mandates, but the consequences of that choice, well, it could cost me. I could ignore my family and prioritise other, other things, but the consequences of that choice could cost me relationally. I could ignore my job and go to the beach all day, but the consequences uh, of that choice could cost me financially, plus sand. I could ignore my friends and lose them. I could ignore the weather and burn or freeze. I could ignore the virus and get sick. I'm not free from consequences, but I am free to choose which consequences I want. So, in my freedom, I'm choosing to protect my family and community by getting vaccinated and wearing a mask when necessary. I'm prioritising time with my families to build quality long-term relationship. I'm committed to my job, which I find fulfilling, which will serve me, my family, and the organisation that I work for in the long term. I heed the advice of my close friends whom I've chosen wisely, which will help me make wise choices. I will run whenever I want, regardless of the weather, but sometimes I will do that indoors on a treadmill so that I can, again, keep running for the long term. I'm choosing to restrict my movement in the short term to stay as healthy as I can for as long as I can. These are the choices that I'm making in my freedom. So 2022 is the year of freedom for me to choose the consequences that I want, which is an unbelievable gift that carries with it a great weight of responsibility.